Hi everyone, welcome to South Farm. It's a farm. Let's go be farmers. <laughs> <laughs> And then, and then, pull it up. Master Weaver. <laughs> <laughs> this is the map. Um, yeah, so if you look at the map first up, then you'll actually know where everything is. Because we came into the parking here, and then I'm not sure what the entrance is. You know, it doesn't really say, but <laughs> it is quite a big place. village is fisherman's village and then the last village is farmer's village and then the tour is self-guided only but there's a farmer that will assist you in every area uh, marvs. 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 marvs thank you marvs, awesome, marvs. <laughs> sounds incredible let's go <laughs> okay, enjoy. thank you this is a souvenir store and they have peanut kisses i've got to get some of these at yeah, some point no, rick we do need to get peanut kisses. and then uh loads of other things i assume they make these at the ba basket weaving and things what is this interesting looking stuff it all looks so interesting i don't see any prices on that so i don't know oh it's got some prices on there but on these things and maybe that's a price maybe. yeah four nine five there you go let the camera be your glasses <laughs> We had to do food first because it's like midday, starving. Uh -huh. <laughs> it says Uma's in the front, so look out for the signs because they, they, they're disguised in camouflage, <laughs> made of wood. But check this place out. It's great, and you are allowed to bring your pet, they must be on a leash. Okay. And they've got watering holes. Oh, awesome. <laughs> ah, I love the, the basket weaving on the roof and the wood. Something. Man, this place is awesome. Well, it looks like they've got. Boho ice cream from the bo. Oh, and they got beer. So you can immediately redeem your voucher for a cold beer. <laughs> yeah. So you pay your entrance, you get a free beer. <laughs> Basically, yeah. <laughs> okay, so here you go. Beautiful looking foods. Breakfasts and salads and sandwiches and pastas and snacks. Oh, and of course, some lovely fish things. Must be for the kids. Oh, and pizza. Hmm. And then your beverages. Well, I think because it's this farm and they grow all their own things, this sounds amazing. It's pizza and it's made for South Farm things. Yeah, they actually have a place to make pizza, it. Yeah, they have a pizza workshop that we, we can't do, unfortunately. And it's mostly for kids. Yeah, yeah. but it would be fun anyway. <laughs> Yeah, and you can do the farm workshop, learn how to make a pizza and stuff. It's mostly for kids, but it seems like it would look like a lot of fun as well. Well, this is where we are. In Klingalau, Bohul, in Landabit, is South Farm. And it's a little hidden gem that people must come and discover, whether you have children or not. Oh, we arrived just in time. So many people are coming here. They've got a whole, a whole jeepney bus and a bus. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> got some awesome wooden art here oh, and some sculptures in the back there but check out this mosaic caribou mosaic it's a water buffalo mm -hmm. <laughs> awesome and then there's bathrooms just around here oh and a massive barbecue whoa that must have just oh it's a mirror <laughs> Oh, awesome bathroom. Because it's a farm, there are plants and wood everywhere. Nice. Oh, and that's the wash basin. Check out these wash basins. Oh, awesome. Pizza's around. Thank you. <laughs> oh, how pretty does oh, that look? Look at that. That's like a farm style pizza. That looks beautiful. Oh, man. Thank you. Yeah, Thank thanks. You. <laughs> Oh, it is mozzarella, but yo. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. oh, it's hot. It's really hot. Mm. Mm -hmm. oh, so that bread too. is so good. Mm. Yeah, they make it in the house. Mm -hmm. It's got oh, like all the flavor of the farm. You can sort of feel like the farminess in it. 
and then that thick mozzarella i mean it's a lot of mozzarella uh -huh. no kidding <laughs> with the mozzarella and then all those wow. beautiful veggies that you know are fresh because they're, they're grown here i was checking out the tabasco to see how many mills it has on it mm -hmm. but he obviously thought it was finished so he brought me a whole new fresh one that's pretty awesome yeah, no, the love that sort of service yeah <laughs> Pizza, not so much. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty awesome place, awesome service. But I would suggest go around, check everything out, then come back and grab your beer. Uh, we were just hungry, so that's why we came here first. I must say, once you move away from the entrance and not knowing how you um, get around, they do signpost. So, Prawn Farm Restaurant, Artisanal vi Village, and Farmer's Village. But we're heading in this way to start with, to see the fire pit. Awesome. Bamboo. Uh-huh. And it is in the sun and it doesn't seem like it's a really huge place so it's probably going to be easy to walk around it's like oh, oh wow there's awesome stuff here huh. and like everywhere you go there are basins to wash your hands huh. forgot to wash my hands <laughs> <laughs> now this was the cool kids area i was just about to point out with the tractors and all sorts of things but this is the fire pit so you can sit around here at night and enjoy a fire. Huh. And then look at this. you got boats and the lake and you can fish in it. Are there loads of fish? I'll come have a look. So in Fisherman's Village, um, there's a lake inside. You can do fishing. And okay. then fishing is catch and pay. Fish wreck. Oh, there. <laughs> oh, man. Apparently you just come here and catch them. Catch I'll them find... 385 a kilo. Okay. And then it's 50, 500 a kilo to cook it. Okay. I'll... I'd feel bad. <laughs> I would. <laughs> we should really do it. But look at them. Oh, these are the fishing rods. <laughs> Take one out, Rick. Just don't cast it. Proper old school fishing technique. What <laughs> <laughs> if I can feed them? Feed them. <laughs> Throw it in. Anything coming up? There we go, oh. there they come. Look at them. Oh, it's going to oh. be really easy to catch them. <laughs> it's going to be a little too easy really to catch unfair. them. <laughs> For those who are interested, they're probably about 400 grams, these ones here. So uh, you're probably overall going to spend about six or 700 pesos in total. Get a really fresh fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you can weigh them when it goes up to 20 kgs. So, yeah. <laughs> but here we are, Prawn Farm. We actually went into the buffet of theirs. You got a romantic dinner by the lake. That would be pretty awesome. But, 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 Ricky's just pointed this out. Uh huh. And they've got the tanks. So you don't have to fish for them. Oh, they don't look like they've got anything in them. They got a crab. But the rest, I don't see anything. Uh, what a, oh, there we are, look at those. Little fishes. Well, you don't actually sit in the restaurant. They've got all these things out here where you can sit and have your own little private area and enjoy these views around the lake. Oh, there's where the ducks are. Oh, we found some ducks. Obviously, someone's feeding them. <laughs> I think I just saw a rooster fighting a duck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he really is. He's like standing there like a like a puppy. They actually have another catch and cook area just over here. I mean obviously you catch it here and bring it up there. It's, but I think it's a different type of fish that goes in here. So I'm just gonna have a quick look. Oh this is Bangus, Rick. Okay. I don't know why I thought Bangus was a sea fish. You can see a few rising in bits, but it looks a lot harder than catching tilapia. Nah. <laughs> Lake's behind us. Now we're heading towards the animals, I think. I think. This is what you got me. Here we go. <laughs> Livestock that way. So all activities in Farmer's Village are free, such as horseback riding, carabao cart riding, and livestock feeding. Please get your badge and pay them for... for ah, there, there we go. We got our badge. No badge, no entry. Let's go, there chickens! 
on the on the old menu of the prawn farm they did have catch and cook native chicken really they removed it now <laughs> go catch your chicken today really yeah they did wow oh, shame there we are can i have that little clump one please <laughs> you gotta catch it run run oh, oh these are turkeys did they have catch and release turkey? Damn pigs! Oh, look at that! Little piggies! And the chickens are coming in to steal their food. Oh wow, they look like a wild boar. They do, they look quite... Whoa! Hey mama! That is definitely a wild boar. Mm -hmm. Have you seen a wild boar? They're mm. little piggies. Suddenly, everyone got a fright. Everyone got a fright and the chickens landed on the pig. <laughs> you see it? Awesome. Oh wow, this is just, this is just weird. Uh -huh. Oh look, look. <laughs> Here we go, little noses sticking out. <laughs> and big noses trying to stick out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Great selection of piggies. There's a rooster there. Oh, are you getting up? Did we wake you up? Ah, go back to sleep. There are loads of them here. Oh, look, there's a lot of them. feed me. <laughs> Let's go feed something. Ricky's coming. I have to share, Rick. <laughs> A little bit too far away, Rick. <laughs> They're going to pull you in. Yes, these are the prized guys because they get fed, whereas the other guys over here, nobody seems to feed them. Are they boys? With their little boy. <laughs> oh no, they can come through. They can all come through. Okay. They're just like company. That one okay? Mm-hmm. I see some people riding horses behind me. Oh cool, let's go check it out. Oh, this is the duck area. You can see they got a little bit of a water pond in there. Some ducks. Let's see if Ricky's got some food. A little bit of corn. Oh, it's hot. Well, I think it's way too hot for ducks. Oh, check it out and see what happens. There's the one in the bun. <laughs> Come get some food. No, no. Oh, there's a peacock. Oh, look, there's a peacock. I'll try to get around. Please do not touch, look for a farmer for assistance. But there's a peacock, where did the peacock go? It was just here, literally just here. Super camouflaged animal, known for its ability to do that. No wait, that's not a peacock. <laughs> so look at this, we got a horse. <laughs> Hi. Look at this. Small horse. <laughs> Small horse, I'm too big for it. <laughs> Soy. Soy. Tea. Tea. Soy. Tea. Soy. Tea. Soy. Yeah. Oh, what a beautiful boy. Native. Yeah. Native horse. Yeah. It's a native horse. Oh, wow. Oh. It's lovely and such a good temperament. Yeah. You can feel by the muscles he's going to be tough. <laughs> Shouldn't have said that out loud. So yeah, guys, you can come here and ride a horse. Just be smaller than us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 80 below. 80, 80 and below. below. There you go. Reason to lose weight. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, there are loads of horses, but you see they get to take turns. But there is a caribou. We're not allowed to get too close, but we want to go have a look. Caribou are a type of buffalo, which are notoriously cantankerous. Cantankerous, the word of the day, guys. He's already got his eyes on us. Yeah. Oh, man. We don't want to get too close. Oh, that caribou back there is actually the Philippines national animal. Goat village. Huh? Ducks. They're ducks. You can get them on. <laughs> hey, ducky duck. Nope. 
goat village. Let's go see if they got some. Oh, they Nubian goats. I love Nubian goats. Feed me. There's some. You can grab some stuff from there. Oh, you can really hear them. <laughs> like food. They got loads of food. He's like, oh no, I've got tons of food. Oh, there you go. Oh, you're going to steal the whole thing. Mm -hmm. There you go, you're in a suit. You want some of mine? <laughs> ah, ah, behind you. <laughs> oh. ah, I stole my whole thing. Ah, that's what they do. <laughs> like one leaf, bro. Serious? <laughs> one leaf. <laughs> do you smell the, the male goats? Yeah, I, I get a, like a musky smell, but it's not like a bad. No, no, it's very strong. It's yeah. for a guy, it's very, very pungent. Right, for a girl, not yeah. so much. It's a weird thing about goats. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, anyway, onwards. Mm -hmm. Oh, here comes lunch. <laughs> Someone out. Oh, <laughs> hiding under the. Oh. Someone is so happy. Go on. Goats are notorious for escaping. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here we go. We're getting the good stuff. Oh, happy day. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, someone else up and about. <laughs> That's why it escaped. Oh. <laughs> what a big boy. Such a cool thing to see. Yeah. Ah, give me, give me, give me. <laughs> Went his own. Go and get to this one again. Uh, <laughs> just going to climb out. Not allowed to be too close. Mm -hmm. People being cornered out. Oh, yeah, you can escape. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, that was cool. There is really a guinea, f uh, what you might call it, peacock there. I'm going to try to zoom in. And that blue thing is the peacock. <laughs> oh, we got some guinea fowl. Hang on, hang on. Hang in there, guys. I come with the good stuff. Here we go. What language is that? Check out those bananas. I <laughs> know it's a turkey. They actually went gobble gobble. Oh well. Got more ducks and what are we in here? Duckville. Chicken camp. Feed me. Yeah. <laughs> no food left guys. Sorry about that. Oh, would you look at that? Little duckling face. Yeah. They're kind of scrappy looking now. They're the ugly duckling. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, look at this area. There's nothing sitting under there, but it's got water. Oh, it's koi. But I hear some sort of animal as well. But check out the koi. No. But there's no feed me station for the koi. Eat until yeah, <laughs> it's a seriously fun interactive area. <laughs> getting out there and feeding everything and looking at all the animals is pretty cool. But now we're heading towards, I think, the greenhouses, which are here. We have a quick look. Did that say tortoise? Yeah. <laughs> Hydroponics and aquaponics. 
It's opening up for us. We just have a quick look. Thank you. Oh wow. So these plants are growing on top of oh it's so much cooler in here. Growing in water. Yeah, do you want me to close that? But it's to do with fish as well. So the fish are actually living at the bottom here. Yeah. And providing nutrient for these plants to grow in the hydroponics. Look at these tomatoes. Wow. I think that the leaf is so wrong, but it looks like a tomato. It's a tomato, right? And they're proper Pomodoro ones. Check them out. Wow. This is awesome. And also hydroponically. Yeah. This isn't soil, it's just the media. And, they keep and it dripping. comes out of here where it gets cleaned by these plants. And the fish. And the fish. Oh so man. Amazing. Oh man, this sort of thing is so cool. <laughs> ah, thank you so much. Yeah, well, you. Man, you just gotta love this sort of yeah. thing. Sustainable. Uh -huh. Awesome, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Toy toys. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. Wait, where is it? Oh, look at him! Oh, he's also got no food left. Oh! Should have stolen food from somewhere else. Really These guys live like 150 years. Oh, where are you off to? Let's see if I can zoom in on you a little bit. Oh, he's running along. I'm not sure if we can see him, but I don't think a tortoise has ever moved this fast before. He loves you. He's coming straight towards us. Where's the food, man? Where's the food? <laughs> We made him run all this way and we don't have food. No, how do we tell him this basket is empty? I think that might be dragon fruit. Yeah. Oh, and they're doing some plowing and stuff here. I don't sort of want to walk there, but I really think that's dragon fruit. Yeah, I reckon. We saw some in growing in Mauritius. Yeah, wow. Yeah, we're not quite sure. I think we got lost because we don't have a map anymore. But we'll carry on along here and see where it takes us. I think we came in from the wrong side because the sign's facing the wrong way. <laughs> Some more greenhouses. Uh, no badge, no entry. <laughs> oh, and they got that giant fruit. Miracle fruit. That's yeah, what that big thing's called. Big thing. I don't, I don't, oh, there we go. Miracle fruit. Whoa, those things are huge. Well, we got like a bit of a herb garden, dill and aloe. And chives. Oh yeah, they named and everything. That's cool. Yeah, with some great art on the wall there as well. Yeah. Kamasala Grazing Area Koi Pond. I don't know. Let's go this way. Oh, this is the farm workshop, Little Uma. So you come here and you learn how to make pizzas and the pottery, pot painting. And pizza making. That's pretty cool. Oh, and there's tons of stuff down there. More people, in fact. Vegetable garden. Oh, and they got gerbils. <laughs> sweet basil, tar basil. More sweet basil, loads of sweet basil. <laughs> He's well traumatized. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet little guys. Uh -huh. Anyway, we found a map so you know where we can go. Loads more gerbils here. Guinea <laughs> pig. I think they can get out of here. Oh, look. Oh, we can get from behind. Yeah, they come out of their houses to here. Maybe I'm fighting over food. <laughs> hey, little guys. Well, some of you are like quite fluffy. <laughs> you can't touch them because they're back. <laughs> Feed me, there's the food. <laughs> wait, wait. There's a station everywhere. There we go, guys. Do you not Look touch what I've got. That you can Here feed. There you go, share. <laughs> Little one, <laughs> yeah, cool. Let's go see some birds. <laughs> Let's wait until we all in, okay? 
And we got, look at all the little birds. Oh, so many little birds. Hey, little guys. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Oh, 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 they're flying up to my head. They're they flying to my head. Oh, they're all over my head. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> ah. <laughs> Everything's just left out of my hands. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, that is so cool. Take your screenshots. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them all in the bucket. <laughs> I love them flying in mid-air thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hi. They'll just fly onto anyone. <laughs> Got no food, but you can still get yourself a, a bungee, what they call lovebird. <laughs> I'm just a tree. Uh -huh. <laughs> the equivalent of a tree. <laughs> and this is what they're called lovebirds. Look at them. Oh, what a beautiful little couple. Do they have eggs? No, no. Uh, this, this is a baby. Is that the baby? Oh, hello, baby. Hello, one. Look at the coconut nests as well. Oh, yeah. It's androgynous. Oh. Yes, you don't know if it's a male or a female, but they do oh. the baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But 10 to 15 years, wow. Oh. I think it might be a little bit too hot for the bunnies. I don't see. Oh, there's one out. But the rest of them are all tuck it up. <laughs> I think it might be too hot for them. We're going inside, we're going to the rabbit, rabbit, hobbit. <laughs> it's like a little hobbit house for rabbits. See if one of them takes, takes my bait. <laughs> hey buddy. Oh, they'll eat the good stuff. Mm-hmm. Can you see them? Yeah. yeah. They're so sleepy. Try this one. <laughs> no, just one of them. We have a lovely tree. This whole area with the, with the little, I suppose, petting zoos. It's really nice and shady. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's awesome. It's just the interaction with the animals. Yeah. It's so cool. You get to feed the birds and the rabbits and get really up close to them. It's awesome. And all of this on Pangala Island, famous for its nightlife and beaches. Yeah. Come out. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful gardens here with the Bogan Villas and there's a scarecrow there. As if Bogan Villas need scarecrows. <laughs> but we're back at this point because we need to go to the, the artisanal village, which is down this way. <laughs> well, it says raffia weaving as well. Panda yen, I don't know what that is. Panda yen. Sounds like woodwork. <laughs> well, this is quite a nice big open area. That looks like a hammock. That really yeah, actually looks swing. like a hammock. Well, there's one of those Connect 3 games in the hammock, but there's a swing. As you know, Ricky and I are good swingers. Awesome. In Artisan's Village, we have our finished products of clay pots. We also have the actual making a basket in basket weaving. Oh, we have cocoa cool. products like vinegar, virgin coconut oil, and coconut candy. Wow. Okay, this is Pen Dian. I think it might be woodwork. Yeah. Wow. They're actually making stuff up there. Look at that. The signpost. Made in house. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Well, this is the pottery, and it looks like they have an old kiln, like wood fired kiln. Yeah. Man, that's properly artisanal. And the other bowls. Actually, I think they have a price for them. Huh? 68 for a pot. Check out these cool pots. Oh, and these are the ones that make the fire in and you cook stuff on top. And then I reckon kids come and make some as well. 
<laughs> awesome, guys. Awesome. Oh, and they've got old potter's wheels. <gasps> Proper old potter's wheels. Where you turn it. Uh-huh. But there's also a modern one, which you use your foot. So you press your foot on it and it turns. Oh, wow. I haven't done that in so long. Now you stand here and you pedal it with your foot. Oh wow. You put your hands on, you center it. This one wasn't centered. But that's how you do it. So you make pots. Huh? Brian the Master Potter. Yeah. Master Potter. I said Master Potter. Master Potter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, basket weaving. I think the whole idea is that you got to come here a little bit earlier in the day. Oh, you, we're weaving. Hi. Look at that. He's actually making something. But, oh, big, big bowl. There's one like that. Yeah. Wow. He's actually making that. Yeah. Wow. Oh. He's letting me have a go. <laughs> right when it's nearly finished. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How do you push it in there? With skill. Oh, you're going to have to show me. In the hole. In the hole. Oh, okay. And then you pull it through. Oh, I got it. I got it. <laughs> no, but you've got to pull it tight. Yeah. Give it back. <laughs> and then you go in the hole. And then, and then, pull it tight. Master weaver. <laughs> Not just a potter. I think his face doesn't say so. Am I good? <laughs> He said yes. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that awesome. was awesome. I'm going to make our lamp shades from now on. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, it does look like if you come on certain times and maybe do the little things, you can actually come and do the pottery. Maybe do some woodwork. I'm not sure about that, but definitely some weaving. It's, it's, it's harder than it looks, guys. <laughs> well, that's a nice tree with some swings and some couches. Couches, benches. Look at that tree. Oh man. Definitely worthwhile visiting here. And what's up for these trees? They're all over the island. Pangalau has forest with giant trees. Oh, find it. <laughs> oh, that would terrify Ricky. Don't know if you can see her there. She is the biggest one I've seen. She looks like a golden orb web. Well, the web is golden. Wow. Yeah, then it has to be a golden orb web. And her body is gold as well. She's way bigger than a hand. I would, wouldn't put my hand there to show you. <laughs> put your hand there, Rick. Okay, so this is the cocoa area. Oh, South Farms Suka. Oh, that's vinegar, I think. Maybe, yeah. And then there's Suka with sil and garlic, and Sinmac, and Suka Plain, and Vuko. Oh, someone's come up. Oh, someone's pitched up. Oh, hi. <laughs> he must be the farmer of the, the coconut stuff. It's your vinegar. Is it made from coconut vinegar? Yes, okay. Oh, wow. Can she try some? Yes, I have good taste. Okay, go and have a taste, Rick. Vico. That's virgin coconut oil, sir. VCO. It's oil, you can't drink it. Oh, you can drink it. You can drink it. Oh, what? Cherries? Mm -mm. Oh, chilies. Okay. Oh. You want to get some barbecue to put that on? That is oh, it's for cosmetics. It's for cosmetics. It's coconut oil. Okay. That's the one used in the spa, massage in the uh -huh. ocean. Oh, culture. so when they do a massage, yeah. this is the one that they're using. I won't but drink they, it because I don't want to. Uh huh. They mix it with. It's like you a carrier oil. He says I can. I can drink it. So That's you mix. Well for cleansing. It's a cleansing. Don't Ooh. drink too much. Yeah, because I have to run off to the toilet. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's kind of light. Ah. It's a very light coconut flavor. Oh, but it sticks around in your mouth. <laughs> I think you're probably going to have to wash that down with some of the vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, awesome. Cool, thank you so much. And you actually make the coconut stuff here. Yes, ma'am. Okay. The vinegar coconut oil. Is the vinegar coconut oil. Just have to clear the palate. Uh -huh. It's a little bit oily. It's not too oily. It's kind of fresh. And I can see drinking that. <laughs> oh. Also. Oh, I forgot it was vinegar. <laughs> Woo. With chilies. <laughs> Cut the vines off. Huh? Oh. Thor is a rubber tree plant. 
Uh-huh. Anyway, I think that's it. Yeah. Another beautiful big tree. Yeah. Mm. There's someone fishing. I don't know if we can see him because of the sun. There. I can't imagine why he hasn't caught anything. <laughs> Unskilled. No, he didn't find the food. <laughs> and the sheep are out. The sheep are out. <laughs> oh, wow. Pina kisses finally. Uh -huh. <laughs> popo, is it a tortoise called a popo? <laughs> Look at them. Oh. Oh, yeah, they're little, they're like Hershey's kisses but made from peanuts, I would think. Ah. I'm just going to try one. Oh, they're hard. Peanut. Should have got the big one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Some sort of game, I think. If you ever know, have played this, we'll know how it works. Comment. Yeah. There's an awesome driver to take us back. <laughs> if you're coming by scooter, it is a dirt road. So, drive slave safely. Oh wow, South Farm, absolutely fantastic. With or without kids, just come and be a big kid yourself. <laughs> well, anyway, right. thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time. And if you enjoyed this video, check out this one. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> we'll get it eventually. <laughs>